Hello guys and gals of YouTube, I'm here with the AC4 Black Flag Let's Play, and we're right in the action here, P as a pirate, oh dear, this is already exciting, I can tell you that now, alright, he's, oh, what a boss, Same thing for this as I do with um, with Skyrim, except in this I have had played other games, but other than that, I haven't gotten that far in my own personal game, and I haven't even done that. Are we just going to sail away? Okay. Got that. Enemy fire! Incoming fire! Enemy fire! Oops. Ooh, map. I accidentally hit that button. Got him. Come on. Got him. Ooh. Making it rain on these guys. From, with that angled shot. That was terrible. How did I get that? What is this? Fire. Don't know what you are. But you're a big ship and you're on. You just got struck by a lightning. Y'all got nothing. Destroyed. Okay, guys. Why would you run towards it? You guys are idiots. Oh dear. We're already fighting an assassin. No, we got. You got the explosion escape. Wow, that is um, that's big. It's awesome. Is it dangerous, Edward? Hmm. Privateering. Is it dangerous? Wouldn't pay so nice if it weren't. Why not sail with the king's navy? Earn a proper wage. Sail under gentlemen. Sod the navy's gentlemen. For every shilling I'd earn, the captain gets six hundred. That's no way to earn a fortune. We don't need a fortune. It's not about need, Caroline. I want food that don't make me sick. I want walls that hold back the wind. I want a decent life. Oh, thank God he has pants on. H how long would you be gone with these privateers? A year, I reckon. Two at the most. All right. No more than two. Promise me. Two years she's willing to wait? Oof. Man. So those are like flashbacks. It's pretty interesting. I love how clear cut of a path it is. He's a good swimmer for a pirate. <laughs> You're an assassin. 
to look at that. <laughs> Was it good for you as well? Havana. I must get to Havana. Well, I'll just build us another ship, will I? I can pay you. Isn't that the sound you pirates like best? One hundred Eskimos. <sighs> Keep talking. Will you or won't you? You don't have that gold on you now, do you? <laughs> oh. Bloody fucking pirates! Sorry for any language. Again, I have no control. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on to you, Snakes B. Let's get this dude. Find the assassin. Come on, mate. We're off to a bad start. Let's go this way. It's a hundred leagues or more to Havana. Will you walk that distance? I hope I don't have to walk that distance. Of course I get lost. Up here. I I already messed up. Yep. to here. <sighs> Come on. Get up. There's a synchronization point. Cape Bonavista. Yeah, see, I, I know some of the buttons. But just a few. Ugh. Posh git. Where's he running to? There's a chest nearby. <gasps> there it is. Hold up, buddy. Let me just grab this real quick. Okay. I have to reclimb everything. What? You can't hold on to that? What a wuss. See, I go out of my way to pick up everything because I know the assassin will be there at the end. Completely. What's that thing? Because I want it. Where is it? Crap. Oh dear. Oh, I've got swords. That's cool. There's a there's a dead boar here. Dude, there are tons of chests here. This guy better be there at the end. Or at least fall somewhere. Not me, the assassin that I'm... We could work together on this! Wow, he, he did... F he... Why don't you just climb up here? And spend less time. Ow! He just shot me!
Dude, I'm so much better than this guy. Get him. Duncan Walpole. That's his name. Cutscene! Senor Duncan Walpole, I accept your most generous offer and await your arrival with eagerness. If you truly possess the information we desire, we have the means to reward you handsomely. Though I will not know your face by sight, I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste, and trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Su más humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward. Ooh, awesome. Oh, he doesn't wear the hood? <laughs> That's stupid. He should really wear the hood. That school will do me just fine. Ooh, it's a boatsy boat. And a synchronized error area. Area. Okay. I'm an eagle. Duncan Walpole. That's an interesting name. Duncan's pretty common, but Walpole. I've never heard of a Walpole. Uh huh. Okay. So these are basically ones that I can move around. Quiet, you You'll hang for the mess you made out there. So, I had nothing to do with this attack. My crew and I had merely anchored to water and resupply. Wait. Be my reason, I should vent your skull. Take my sugar. Take anything you like. They have tortoises. God's grace, sir. You saved me. A profusion of thanks. Is that yours? It is my vessel, yes. But uh, here lies its poor captain, and I have no art for sailing. I can pilot it's it cool. myself. Oh. No mind. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. What's your name, friend? Steed, Steed Bonnet. Mr. <laughs> Bonnet. Let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for his majesty the king, God save him. And I must get to Havana with speed. Ah, oh, that is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies, then. Ooh, cool. Do you think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared? Did you? Yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. <laughs> gave me quite a fright. But all things considered... I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? Ooh, treasure. Lacking a rowboat, I'm afraid we'll have to swim. Oh. Into my ship. Oh, this 
this is on our island. Hardly the worst thing to happen. Yeah. It's like in here somewhere. What? Awesome sauce. Dude, I'm rich. What if I waddle around in the water? Can I, like, kill these or what? They just walk around. Never mind, I guess Mr. Edward forward slash Duncan really likes to swim. schooner but well suited to my purpose trafficking cargo from my plantation and such she'll do fine there's a strong wind now let's strike to full shall we lose all and twin shots of the wind ah there's a tug of the wind at my hair ah, i find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean the raw stink of of possibility <laughs> that's a top way of seeing it mate This is pretty hard. But the slower I go, the easier it is to steer. So. We're quite animated by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger, do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stalk the windward passage between Cuba and Hispaniola. Oh, I see. Yes. That is a bustling strait. Perfect. Don't worry about being waylaid by pirates, truth be told. My ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane, it's yield, molasses, rum, that sort of thing. <laughs> There's not a pirate living who turn his back on a keg of rum. Well, yes. Yes, I suppose that's true. Exciting first episode, eh? Sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I. promising whoa all right guys i think we're gonna stop right there with a cliffhanger i'll uh, see you guys in episode two i guess rusty sentry out